yes this is uh, third unit test again third unit has been divided into two and so there are two tests on unit three the previous session that's uh, 37 uh, only first two questions uh, are questions and first two, uh, two uh, uh, poems are given and in this session 38 other two poems poem number three and four are asked here pattern is the same annotation first uh, which are compulsory to answer four marks each that will make up 16 marks and then uh, essay type answers which will fetch you seven marks each so overall it will be 30 marks test okay uh, observe these annotation questions no I don't want to be a, a hodgepodge of culture that's one in the second Kaveri flows in my veins Chamundi hills rise in my mind with stars afloat this is second and the third I am true to my lord oh my companions there is nothing to be ashamed of now since I have been seen dancing openly in the last one leaving these troubles behind I go to the other side a hidden knowledge has taken hold of me I hope you remember how to answer these annot annotation type of uh, questions now you have to state where the, where are these lines taken from I mean text or the poem whatever and then who says or uh, why and in which context that's how it is a reference to context question in the questions uh, of essay type how does Sayyad Amanuddin argue against labeling writers explain or Sayyad Amanuddin breaks the rules of English language and punct punctuation elucidate second question I am true to my lord exhibits Mirabai's divine love for Lord Krishna discuss or discuss the characteristics of a bhakti movement or bhakti poetry in India so with this uh, wish you happy writing